Hello everybody, my name is Proud Jisho, and welcome back to more Let's Play The Walking Dead Season 2, Episode 5. Last time we started the episode, uh, we, well, we kind of knew that Rebecca was dead by the end of the last, the last episode, Episode 4, and then we took stop at a, basically like a electric generator. Now, uh, it's morning and we're walking. Okay, better follow the power lines because, you know, that'll lead to the, like, the city. You Why are they so good. far out? Yeah, yeah, I'm good. If I, if I start to crap out, I'll let you know. Okay, will you do that? It's no trouble. How much further? Close. Very close. You've been saying that every time I ask. Please. Yo. I'm really starting to think you're full of shit. It can't be much further. Behind you! What the fuck? Ah! 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 Shoot! Jesus Christ! Yo, where's Arvo? Where's Arvo? Get that Russian Arvo! Fucker came out of oh, nowhere. There he is. That was real loud. Hopefully, there aren't more of them. Yeah. Well, let's move. We don't want to be around to find out. He's very close. Come. He's very close. How close is very close? Like, you know, feet, meters, miles. There. That piece of shit is half built. We're here for the supplies, not the house. It's warm. Fireplace. Very warm. I'd just like a place to sit, if I'm honest. As long as there's food, who cares what it looks like? You're yeah. not gonna think that when you wake up with a couple inches of snow covering you. Are we just gonna walk over? Go around it. Maybe there's a way around. I don't see any. Well, look carefully. I'm Say it, an American asshole. It's okay. Walk. Ice. No shit ice. That's the problem. He's saying it's fine. I go first. I can be front. No. If we just go real slow, it'll probably be okay. Yeah, no need to rush this. We need to spread out, just to be safe. Less weight, the better. I want to be arm, arm length apart. So That's the it's best okay. way, guys. Arm length apart. Well, that's how they say in school dances. Gotta be arm length apart. Can't be like one inch. Not two inches. Anyway. Okay, guys. Slowly. Yo, what's that over there? Okay. Don't worry. Yo, all those walkers. We got some walkers behind us. That's only a few of them. Should be all right. Let's just get to the house. Walk slowly. Hey, stay with us. Fuck. With thin on mighty thin ice here. Hey, motherfucker! Shit, he's gonna kill him. Kenny, get back here, you piece of shit! I should let you drown, you piece of shit. No, Kenny, don't run. Careful, guys. Walk well, it. slowly. Oh, Luke, no. You've been with us since episode one. Don't come over here. 
Okay, I can make it. It's it's fine. You sure? Yeah. You got walkers on the way. Let me help it's too you. Too thin for both of us. I just I just got to be careful. Oh, no, no. You said about being careful on the no. lead that you freaking hurt. I'm fine. I'm fine. No, you're not. I just got to pull myself out. You need help, Luke. The ice is too thin. I got it. You need to help. No. Clem, go. Go help no, him. No, Clem, do not. Just go back for him. You're lied. You, Stop you can do telling it. her that. Clem, look at me. Pull out your gun and shoot those damn walkers, okay? Just give me a little time. Claim you can make. Uh, uh, hold on, hold on, hold on. I, 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 I want to look this up because I want to save Luke. I want to save Luke, so. Uh. Hold on. Okay, uh. Save. Luke. I need episode five. Can I save him? Cause I want I want him to be alive. Oh. Uh. Come on. Uh, <laughs> I don't want I don't want Luke to die. No, Luke is awesome. You know he stole my girl. He, she is mine. She is mine, Luke. Come on, phone, phone, work your magic. Yep, yep, yep. Mm. One. Hey, hey, no, no, phone, phone, phone. On phone. Ah, uh, come on. Uh. Mm hmm. Either way, ah, God, I I'm, I'm going to save Luke. But you need to go. Clementine, stop. Clementine. I'm the lightest one here. Just go back. Please. I got you. Please. Go it's gonna be alright. You know, you could use your gun to, like, you know, extend your reach. Oh, oh, yeah. Just go back to the entrance. And since where could zombies blow? Come on. Yo, go, go through there. Yo, help him, help him. Yo, what's up with their eye? What's up with their eye? Yo, missing eye, missing eye there. I got you. Come on. Come on, you're gonna be okay. Go to the house. We need a fire. She's gonna fucking freeze to death. 
Luke, no! You were my man! My man, man! I'm, I, I'm all right. She's gone. Luke's fucking gone. We should have gone around. God damn it. We should have just fucking gone around. God damn it. It's my fault. I, sh I should have stayed with him. I said I started to know there was nothing in it, wasn't there? I tried to help him. Luke. No! You son of a bitch! This Yo, it's not his fault. fault! Kenny, don't, man! So what? It's nobody's damn fault! The hell it ain't! It wasn't Marvo's fault! Luke was shot! And who got him shot? Not him! Look at this place! Just a stack of fucking toothpicks! Bet those magical supplies are bullshit too. What? No speaking of English? Fuck you. You fucking commie piece of shit. Get it. Fuck you. Yo, stop it. You And that that pink, that purple, that mushy, that gushy stuff. That baby, baby. What did you do? I, I don't even know what's on this frequency. There's another just like it. He wasn't lying. Kenny, why why do you have to run rush? Dang. You want to tell me how a can of fucking chili is gonna help? How me? is beating a kid to death gonna help anyone? This is your fault. And you damn well know it. Dang, you clums my lips are freaking purple. I'm tying him up. Like blue. Fine. Mike, help me get a fire started. You okay? It's hurt real bad. Mike. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Yeah, I'm, I'm totally not, not, you know, freezing to death here. Totally not freezing to death. Take a look at you, kid. Jesus. He could have killed you. What the fuck is wrong with him? You're up. Kenny's out back trying to get some stupid truck started. Here, you should eat something. You okay? Why can't we see her eating? Come on, really? All you see is like put her hand in the can and like, and then nothing. It just hasn't felt this, this shitty in a while. We have to move on now. I know. I know. Uh, 
You have me now, Jane. And all you need is me. I knew this would happen. I knew it. Always does. We'll be okay. Trust me. If you say so. I'm gonna find something to clean that up. Thank you. Thank you. I can't take this shit anymore. Feeling better? Yeah. Hell of a day. But we gotta get moving. Yo, if you're let's stay a few it, days. I could use a hand out back with this truck. This house ain't worth the crap, but the vehicles ain't in bad shape. With a little luck, we can get one fixed up. And be out of here by nightfall. Just give me a minute. I'll wait for you out back. I'll watch him. Oh, baby, I know eyes. Clem, just be careful. Okay, come on, come on, come on. What did she have to say? I know she was running her mouth. What did she say? You shouldn't have done that to Arvo. I know. I know, Clem, but, but Luke... I don't care. You can't do that. Jesus, Clem, you know me. You know I'm not like that. You scared me. You scared all of us, Kenny. Especially me. Again. That's a promise. Wait, wait, wait. Is that really a promise? <sighs> what happened? It's over. But AJ needs us now. We gotta stick together on this thing, alright? Come on. Let's see if the truck's gonna go. He always had a half dozen wrecks he was fixing up. He was a mean some bitch, but he taught me respect. Girl like my, Jane, my thing about respect thing is, about that. if you want respect, you got to give me respect first. We're all just tired. Hell, I've been tired for two years. All right, <laughs> give it a turn. <clears throat> Yes, yeah, so we're so close, Clem. With a little bit of luck, I can get this thing running, and then we can get out on the road and really make some distance. Mm. But does it have gas? Wellington's got to be out there. Now, those rumors can't all be bunk. I mean, hell, there's got to be something out here other than snow and goddamn Euro trash. Mexico. What about Mexico? Why? You want a taco? No, I want a churro. Give me a churro. Long time ago. I've had churros in years. Churros are freaking good. All right. Like, the last time I had it was like I went to Epcot, I think. And like they, they were like, oh. Turtles. Did you turn it? Yes. God damn it. <sighs> we'll get it working. We got to get moving if we're going to keep AJ alive. We're running out of time. I got to get this thing to start. Yeah, I'm going to try warming up the battery. Go on inside. I don't like leaving him with that girl. Well, lots of trust, trust issues with Kenny. Huh. Okay. Okay, hurry up to that.
pick up thing. I wonder why Kenny didn't try this. Finish this place. Kenny could like use her. Like that would be like a beast. Generator Rex. Well, we can, you know, take a look at it, try to see if try to make it work. Busted. Damn. It looks like it's about to collapse. Not even like, uh, hopefully, it's not like, you know, like 45% clear, 50%. Smoking is bad for ya. When didn't you see a drug at? Really, you're you asking a kid? No thanks. No. You asking what an eleven year old to smoke? No, that's bad. That's bad parenting. Kids, don't don't you ever smoke? Smoking is bad. My mom used to smoke for like over ten years, and like. Year ago, two years ago, she stopped smoking. She just saw. Even if it's something you know don't do drugs, kids. Go on. You can be honest. I wish I never took anything from Arvo. I'll bet he does too. Well, I'm guessing, well, like, if we didn't take the medicine from Arvo, you know, then AJ I'll wouldn't be alive. No matter where you end up. There's always one bad seed rocking the boat. But I don't think he would have ever been that guy. Let me ask you something, Clem. When's the last time anyone did what you wanted? Oh, it's been a long time. Uh. I think people respect me. Really? I think so. Well, good for you, honey. Just just looking like respect you, ha! <laughs> you know, Who I've respects been all you? Over, run with a lot of people, a lot of men, and listen to a lot of promises. Ain't one of them come true. I'm starting to think there might be another way. You know? I'm gonna go take a piss. Okay. I don't really need to know that. Ooh. Let's go back inside. What's up, girl? Mike and Arvo wouldn't shut up, so I moved him in here. God damn it! I've seen that look before. Son of a bitch! Oh, damn it. I can't believe what he did to Arvo. Hmm. Next time he's gonna kill him. Do you really want to be around for that? I know Kenny's a nice guy, Clem. I bet Carver was a nice guy, too. Once. Probably had a nice job, a nice pretty wife. Then all this happened. And one day he caved some kid's face in and realized he could sleep at night. Hmm. We can still make this work. All I'm saying is, start thinking about what happens if you're wrong. You two have known each other a long time. Sooner or later, you're gonna have to decide how much that's worth. I think it needs food or something. Change diapers. 
Oh, they were staring, so. Seems like you've done that before. Mm. You want to try? No way. It's going to puke. Clem, no. No, no, uh, uh, uh. Hold it like this. Hey, hi. <laughs> My name's Jane. I think it's gonna puke. It's not gonna puke. It's gonna it puke. puke. It puked. Hmm. Gross. Yeah. <laughs> it's gonna puke. It's gonna puke. <laughs> and I realized that she kept on saying it, so like he. I was running with some people a long time ago down near DC. Some guy got trapped in the middle of a crosswalk. Can't remember his name. He used to call me Mary Jane. He was a douchebag. Anyway, the dick got stuck under a car hiding from a dozen walkers. One after another, they went down there trying to save him. Lost four people before we got him out. They had to try, right? Didn't find out till later he was already bit. Turned and ripped the neck right out of this old lady. Ew. The look on her face was... She was just staring up at the sky. Like she was watching a bird. Look, Clem. He got it working. Okay, got the truck working. It works? What I tell you. So what's the plan? How much food do we have? At least a week. And for the baby? Not much. We need to find a place for the baby. Yeah, the place warm. I agree. Does it have head heater? South. What? We're kind of freeze to death. I don't know whose stupid idea it was to march up here in the first place, but bad one. She's right. What if we went back to house? Wait, what? Fuck that. I was thinking more like Texas. Texas? What the fuck? What? Well, the Funimation Company's there. We need to go to Texas. We We're going to find Wellington. Right, Clem? Wellington? Kenny, it's freezing up here, man. It's only gonna get worse. We came this far. We're not going back. Nah, man, I'm in the middle of it. Can, 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 we, can, we just, can we just leave? Well, that sounds sensible. Damn it, we don't have time. Says you. Look, I don't give two shits about what you people think. I got this truck working, so I say where we go. And we're heading fucking north. It's the best chance we got to help an AJ. Yeah, but like how? What about Arvo? Who? Oh, the Rusky? Yeah, he ain't coming with us. You're just gonna leave him here? I don't give a good goddamn where he goes. He's done. He could die. Better him than another one of us. We have to bring him with us. He knows the area. He can help us. Oh, yeah, some help he's been. He got Luke killed. I ain't gonna say he helped the situation. But maybe if you'd eased up on him before, he wouldn't have run away in the first place. You ever think about that, Kenny? Either way, I'm not going anywhere in the middle of the night. Yeah, me neither. There could be a herd out there. You want that child's blood on your hands, Mike? We're all gonna die out here if you don't calm the fuck down, Kenny. Haven't we been through enough for one day? Jesus fucking Christ. Remember the last time we had a working car and sat around on our asses, Clem? I'm going inside. God damn it! You can't just walk away from us. Dang. Shouldn't that reflection mirror be of the mirror uh, of the car? For his sake. Get 
the fuck out of here! It's me! Clem! Sorry. Yeah. Mm. Give me a second. Kiki! Close the door. Can you believe this, Clem? I bring them a working truck, and they act like I just shit in their cereal. I knew Jane would have a stick up her ass, but I thought at least Mike would have more sense. He's turned out to be a real disappointment. They're scared of you, Kenny. Well, if their big plan is to wander around in the woods, they ought to be scared of more than me. Did you hear me? We're all scared. Mm. Look, we got maybe a day's worth of food for that kid left. That's it. They said a week. Clem, think about Rebecca and Alvin. I mean... What if Lee hadn't gone tearing across half of Georgia looking for you? A lot of folks died to make that happen. A lot of folks died to get us this far. We owe it to them to see this done. I know. You're right. Someone's got to keep this group together. That kid's depending on us. <sighs> that, that reflection there is kind of weird. What'd you think he'd say? I think he'd tell me to try to keep the group together and to keep my hair short. Mm. We can't just give up on this kid. I mean, what's the point of going on after that? That's what people like Lee knew and what people like Jane won't ever understand. Look, I know Wellington might be bullshit, but where there's smoke, there's fire. Krista heard about it too, right? You know, when I first saw you back at that lodge, I thought I was dreaming. And when you sat down next to me and we shared that meal, well, I could tell that you were different now. Grown up. I, I felt pride. A pride I hadn't felt in a long time. A pride for what? But I need you now, Clint. There have to be folks doing better than us. It's the only chance that child has. Yeah, but we can't do it alone. We need the others. And that's why I gotta be able to count on you, Clem. We gotta convince him. You and me. Look, we'll figure everything out in the morning. Yeah, hopefully. Come on, let's get some sleep. Cause we gotta be ready. Hmm. And uh, I think we're gonna call this an episode right here, guys. Thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, like, favorite, share with all your friends. Check out the links in the description below. And I will see you guys next time for the next part of Let's Play. The Walking Dead Season 2, Episode 5. See you guys then. Power out. Yeah!